Bob Norton, founder and creator of Airtight Management, and this is training to create world-class companies and world-class teams. If you take these courses and learn to use most of these with some experience, you'll probably know more about business than 80% of CEOs out there. This is a lot of material. That's going to be at least 120 minute videos. So plan your career and your path around that as you see fit. This video is a level three, 301 video, and it's really about uh, implementing dashboards, which is something that a very senior manager should do, not a new manager. You'll find out how many skills are required to do this properly because you need people skills, you need technical skills, you need broad business understanding. And we're going to give you a checklist to manage the risk because implementing change in an organization requires not just management and planning, but also leadership, mathematics, and other things, understanding of psychology of people to do this right. Most big IT implementations fail because the people that implement them are lacking in the planning, psychology, management, and leadership skills necessary to make the organization adapt to the change. So remember that this is actually part of system three of airtight management, which is a holistic, complete system that helps companies become a high performance company. If you do all six of these things well, you'll probably be in the top few percent of companies in the world because most companies don't even do two of these uh, reasonably well. Even a lot of very mature, uh, older companies that have had years and years uh, to develop their internal systems. So today, in this segment, we're going to talk about the overview of the dashboard creation process, and there'll be other segments that dive into the details of each of these. This is not for the faint of heart. Implementing this is best done by a professional expert consultant, and I know I have a conflict of interest in recommending that because my company does that, but it's true nonetheless. It's a fact, and you'll understand how many skills are, are required to get this done right uh, as we go through it. So we've divided the process into these four steps. Typically someone is going to feel a pain or identify a need. They're going to need to uh, allocate a budget and time to implement something and then to research and plan out that and probably select a vendor that's going to help them a lot of people make the mistake of focusing on a software selection and the real magic should happen in the business process and the business drivers, not the software. As a matter of fact, we recommend every company implement their dashboards initially only using spreadsheets or very simple things so that the IT process doesn't get in the way and doesn't require a lot of changes and then you can implement the automation of that in IT later. The second stage is the discovery phase and, and these stages two, three, and four are the classic consulting engagement. If you're hiring a consultant, by definition, you don't know what the solution is and probably don't understand the problem fully or you would have hired a contractor that had a known skill set which you could manage. So you've got to give the consultant time to poke around, figure out what the issues are, make sure you're getting at the root problem, not just symptoms of the root problem, and present a plan after discovering all of the issues involved. Um, the design phase is when you're actually making the details of that plan. It should have a timeline and costs and who's got to be involved and all those types of things. It doesn't have to be a complex plan, a couple pages saying here's what we'll do each week. We'll give you a sample of one of those a little later. And then an implementation plan, which is starting to get the corporation to adopt what has been designed. So this small series of videos is going to cover all this. First with an overview and then we'll drill down to each of these uh, implementation or discovery and design phases uh, in more detail.